My name is Miss Bartholomew. We're here at Marin Oaks mm -hmm. and we're doing a bunch of mini murals around campus. And I have a student here, Miguel, who uh, designed and is painting this door. Yeah. Um, so we kind of just decided we wanted to do something bright, colorful, you know, lively. So students can come to school and see the door and just, you know, have a little inspiration, a little um, upbringing of joy throughout their day. And uh, so we did two doors. This is our first door that we started painting. This door is more like a geometric um, kind of, you know, abstract sort of piece. And then our next door is more line work. This was just a... Uh, you know, creating shapes and putting them together and, you know, just having something pleasing to the eye. So this is our second door. This door was a little more well thought out and is a little more intricate. We tried to do more line work and uh, make it a little harder on ourselves. And uh, right now we're thinking about changing up. So these lines, when they come off, they're gonna be white, um, but we wanted to add black lines as well. So we're gonna have to paint these first and then add the tape. So it could be different color lines and it'll be even more awesome to look at. Okay, so um, this is Duffy's door. He's our social studies teacher, world history, ethnic studies, US history. So we wanted to uh, represent people from um, Mexico, uh, civil rights activists, and um, LGBTQ activists too, to represent um, some of the people in history that got into the good kind of trouble. Uh, so what inspired me for my door was it being the meditation room and something just like peaceful. And I went with something like Japanese. So we got Mount Fuji and we still need to do a bunch of the texture, but we got the sky, the mountain, and then we're gonna do the water and we're just gonna shade it. And there's a boat on the water and we're also going to do a cherry blossom tree that's going to come in from the side and like just lean on top of everything and yeah pretty much it. um this is my door and basically my inspiration was to have a powering message to it and um basically just to say like to never give up and to always keep on going and having these like colorful um, colors is to just make it stand out and um, just to show and embrace your true colors. Uh, my design, basically like what it means is like, it's like a record right here because that's what we created in here. We, we, uh, we produce in and uh, mix and master and all that, you know? And uh, so like, you know, it's a city on top. Like it's, it's San Francisco for real, but I don't know, it's kind of like a rough tracing of it. Uh, like, cause that, like, it's supposed to symbolize like this right here. Like, it's it's the music being made and it, and it gets put out into a record and it goes into the like, into the world type. You know what I mean? Like, so this is the math door, and the math teacher really likes owls, so we decided to do like a big owl uh, on like a nighttime background with on a branch, and we kind of have this geometric design to make it just like more angular and it kind of pops out more. And then right now we're in the chalk tracing phase where we're getting the chalk onto the door to paint it later. So this is my door. This is Mr. Duffy's door. It doesn't really have any meaning why it's here. It's just, it did, I didn't want it to kind of be in a corner where nobody could see it. So I just wanted it someplace more out. And it's just kind of like a sun with some pretty flowers at the bottom. And right now I'm just doing the outlining with the paint pen and then ¿Cuándo empezaron este proyecto? Nos vamos, nosotros empe empezamos a hacer este proyecto el lunes y nos tomó dos días hacerlo completos. Ok, pero de, el diseño ¿cuándo lo empezaron? Eh, lo empezamos hace tres semanas. Ok. ¿Y qué les inspiró para escoger este, este diseño? Lo que nos inspiró fue la clase. Pensamos que este diseño era perfecto porque es donde nosotros aprendemos es, este salón ah este salón es donde aprenden nosotros inglés. aprendemos inglés okay y creemos que es es, es muy importante okay y qué significa para ti este ah este diseño significa pasión emoción para aprender eh, y enfoque okay y muchas cosas más ¿Y habla de sus raíces tal vez sí okay Sí.